Hi, this is Amber from Mommy Has an Android Now, and I want to show you some features of the browser on the Nexus One. So when you go to the browser, uh, it comes up with your home page, and if you go to the toolbar, um, you can select Windows, and it brings up all the browser windows that you have open. You can close them automatically from here, or you can go to them. You can choose more, and for more you can select text, like if there's a blog and you want to get some text off of it that you like, you can select it and it's copied automatically to your clipboard. You can go to settings, and there's tons of settings here, um, like it changes your default zoom, since everyone's talking about the multi-touch and pinch to zoom. This um, controls when you push the plus and minus bars how close in and far out it goes. Um, you can change the text size. I have mine set to huge. If you have trouble reading or you know you want to display a little bit more, you can control that here. Um, you can block pop-ups. Up, pop you can choose not to load your images. You can um, change all sorts of things here. Open the background. Here's where you set your home page. Clear your cache. Um, remember passwords. Clear passwords. All sorts of things here. Also under more, you can share a page, and then you click on Twitter, and you can type in a little message here that says something and it automatically tweets it for you. It already put it into the um, tiny URL for you. Um, other things you can do. You can um, find on page, so you can search within a web page, find the text. You can check and see what all downloads you've downloaded from your internet browser. I don't currently have any downloads, but that's where you'd find them. and add a bookmark. You can also get the page info which gives you the specific of the page you're on. If you're in the middle of loading a page and it's taken a while to load, um, which my pages are all already loaded I think. Let's see, maybe there's one page that's not loaded. Maybe while it's loading, if you bring up the menu you can press stop instead of refresh and it just stops loading it. So those are a few features of the browser that you can control on the Nexus One.